got the list? Okay, I'll check the oil, meet you inside, and Haley, be careful, careful of, of what, what I say. I know, I you know. You got it. Buck? Yeah? You be careful of what you I say. what I say, I got it. Go on, get. Thanks, Mrs. Parsons. Like better see you, Mom? You from around these parts? No, my dad and I are camping. A little late in the season to be setting up camp, isn't it? We like to camp this time of year. Fewer people around. Yeah, well, most folks have their kids back in school about now. Don't mind him, honey. He's the biggest gossip on the mountain. He has to know everybody. The oil's okay. You got everything? Good. How much really? Uh, that'll be ten fifty, sir. All right, ten. And uh fifty on the money. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Questions. What kind of question? Just the usual, nothing big. Well, that's okay. Let's make tracks. I'll tell you, Bernice, I've seen that face somewhere before. According to you, you've seen everybody's face. No, no, I've seen that face. There. There, I told you. Now, what do you say to that? Good Lord, you're right. What are you going to do about it? Do? I'm going to call the sheriff. That's what I'm going to do. I'm surprised your hair don't fall out the way you brush it so much. Buck, have you ever heard of split ends? They're football players, ain't they? <laughs> You're so weird. So are we going to stop by and see that friend of yours, the ranger? Retired ranger. Yeah, maybe we will. I haven't seen Jesse in a long time. And if my memory serves me correctly, he has a boy about your age. And a good-looking one, too. <laughs> <laughs> uh, cross your fingers, sweetheart. Hang on, kiddo.
about it. This is it. They left some surprise behind. Boy, that cowboy could sure drive. Just talk to the chopper, Sheriff. They haven't seen nothing up top. Great. The dogs had them for a while, but they must have doubled back by the highway. Probably hitched a ride. They're long gone by now. Yeah, well, thanks for trying, Harv. Tahoe Sierra to Tahoe Control. This is Tahoe Control. Go ahead, one-liner. Pat, we got problems. Get on the phone to the High Mountain Rangers. Tell them we got a kidnapping up here. What time you figure it is? I figure it's about five minutes later than the last time you asked around 3.30. I figure you got something you want to do, huh? Now, we'll get this done first. Well, that's good, because when we finish bailing this hay, we'll go up the roof and patch it. Roof. But if you had something more important to fix than the roof, then. No, that's OK. But it would have to be real important, like fishing. Now, that's important. You want to go fishing? Yeah. I like to go fishing. But I wouldn't want to take you away from your work. No problem. I'll get the poles. Somebody coming? Who is it? I don't know. Somebody must be lost. Hey! Yes! Looks like Buck. God, it is, Buck. Buck, you look like hell. Yeah? Well, you're still knee-high to a fire hydrant and twice as ugly. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you. Good to see you, Emilio. Well, I guess we've got some introductions to make. Son, I don't know if you remember, but when you were about five years old, I took you to a rodeo in Truckee, and there was this big Brahma bull that put this man right on his back and then started stepping on his face. <laughs> this is my son, Cody Hawks, Buck Dawkins. I remember. Me too, Cody. Bull's name was Pistol Pete, and I got 12 stitches on my lip. Well, gentlemen, right now, this is the star of my show. This is my daughter, Haley, Jesse and Cody Hawks. Hi, Haley. Hi, Mr. Hawks. My dad talks about you all the time. <laughs> 